Arizona Game and Fish has completed its testing of deer and elk for chronic wasting disease for the 2011 hunting season. The department tested 1,185 deer and elk during the 2011 season and did not detect the disease in any Arizona animals. Testing will resume this fall. Chronic wasting disease, or CWD, is a neurological disease that attacks the brain in deer, elk, and moose and is characterized by progressive weight loss, abnormal behavior, and eventually death. It causes the animals to behave abnormally because it basically puts holes in the brain and a holy brain doesn't work too well. So um, they have abnormal behavior. They may act like they're blind. They may do a lot of salivating. They have an increased um, desire for water, so they, they want to drink a lot. And they don't raise their young normally. And so this can reduce the number of animals that reproduce. Chronic wasting disease has been found in deer and elk in Colorado, Utah, and New Mexico, but it has not been detected in Arizona. In New Mexico, it is limited to the areas east of the Rio Grande. Um, so there's a, not only a lot of territory, but a fairly significant river between um, the infected animals here and the border of Arizona. And in Utah, it is north of the Glen Canyon recreational area, so it's north of the Grand Canyon and Lake Powell, and um, there's a lot of very rugged territory between Arizona and Utah. Because CWD is um, quite a bit of ways away from Arizona, and the disease is transmitted by animal movement primarily, um, we are not expecting CWD to show up in Arizona in any short period of time. We have been monitoring deer and elk in Arizona for the presence of the disease for more than 10 years and have not detected it in any of the thousands of animals that we have sampled. And we are going to continue monitoring for it. Arizona Game and Fish is doing the heaviest monitoring along our border with New Mexico and on the Kaibab Plateau south of the Utah line. We are looking for it in the deer and the elk that are harvested by our hunters here in the state. Um, we have check stations set up on the Kaibab. We remove the lymph nodes from the throat area of the deer and elk, and those are sent to a lab and tested for the presence of the prion. And we do a similar check station in eastern Arizona as well, or um, hunters can bring their animals to a regional office or um, we have a number of taxidermists and meat processors, game meat processors, that are working with the department to save us the lymph nodes from the animals so that we can test those. So it's, it's quite an extensive operation using a lot of different personnel um, and every year we test around 2,000 samples. and. Um, that's enough to detect the disease in, if it were occurring in less than 1% of the animals. So that's um, a very significant sample size and we can definitely say that we do not have chronic wasting disease in our deer and elk herds in this state. Arizona Game and Fish is continually working to help our state maintain its CWD free status. In 2010, we developed a new CWD response plan and management plan. And in that response and management plan, we identified some changes that we needed to make to the rules in order to reduce even further the possibility of introduction of CWD into the state. And the first thing that we identified was that we should prohibit people from bringing in intact carcasses and untreated, untaxidermied um, mounts and trophies. So they were going to change the rule that way. The additional thing that we identified is that should we detect CWD in Arizona, we should have a response plan, which we now have. While CWD is fatal to deer, elk, and moose, there have been no reported cases of humans ever being infected. Researchers have been 
really pushed to try and determine whether or not people are susceptible to chronic wasting disease and there is no evidence to date um, that people can get chronic wasting disease. So it's limited strictly to deer and deer species. So deer, elk, and moose are all very closely related and they are susceptible, but people are not.